Welcome to Marine Tech Hub. Today I will be explaining you about the rotating rectifier in a synchronized generator. In this picture you can see these are the three generators here 1, 2 and 3. So normally when we start one generator we will have a voltage of 440 volts. In this case what happened was the voltage was 120 to 140 volt we got. So voltage was not building up. So another case it can happen is the voltage can be higher maybe it is 500 to 600 volt. Both the cases I will be telling you how to look into it so that you will understand better. So I would like to explain to you uh, what these are. You can see this is the rectifier 6 and we have 6 diodes. So how to check the diodes I will be explaining you. If these diodes are open condition, then you have low voltage. But if one of the diode is short circuited, then you will have 500 to 600 volt. So in our case, the voltage was less. So we are going to check the diodes. So diodes you can check here. You can see in this picture, this is actual electrical drawing where you have the diodes here, rotating diodes. This is a rectifier. So you have to check the diodes. I am not talking of other circuit which is there. I will explain to you more in detail. But I am talking about the diode. So how to check the diodes. So if you see this. Uh, open the top cover of the alternator. You can see the diodes here. You can see the white color one which is attached. This is the rotating diodes. So how to check these diodes. I will be explaining you in detail so that you will understand them better. So if you see this, uh, this is one more diode here. I got two of them with me. So this is the diode. How to check this diode? You can see there are three terminals here. So I will just uh, show you how much voltage is coming. If you put these two terminals, you are getting 0.4 across you get 0.4 here you can see this reading I am changing you can see the reading how these are the new one so how it should work it should be working like this if one of the reading you are not getting it correctly then you are not able to uh, get the right voltage so this is how you have to check so one thing you, you check one side positive and other side negative diode normal diode how you check it is the same method keep the indicator in the diode mode here so that you will be able to check it so if this is good you change all the diodes at a time so that it is better so if you have any doubt regarding checking of the diodes you can message me thank you